sorry for my major absence. Like, I've been gone for about three or four weeks now. Like, I would say this is my going on my fourth week that I've been absent of filming videos. And it's not the fact that I haven't been able to film, it's just the fact that I'm really lazy to film and I'm really lazy to upload. And plus, I've been having a lot of homework with like English and also math has been like slam packed with math work and I'm just like, I'm literally like lost, like, I don't know what to do. And exams are like right around the corner and like the end of May and I'm just like, can you not? Like, can you not? So I thought, and since of my absence, I would do a haul for you guys. And I, but before I do any of the little haul, I wanted to say I have a Snapchat and I also have an Instagram and a Twitter. So I would love for you guys to go follow me on Instagram and Twitter and add me on Snapchat. I will link everything down below so we can, you know, you know chat all the time on Snapchat. I love, I'm literally addicted. Like that would probably have to be my most used app since April has started so you might see that in an upcoming favorite video but yeah, I basically have a collective haul for you guys I have like dresses and like clothing pieces and a little bit of makeup and some bath and body work stuff so yes I'm gonna start with the bath and body work stuff first because I want to because you know yellow without further ado Let's get started. Um, I got three lotions because they were having a sale. And the first one I got is Amber Blush. And this is just, you know, has my name in it because, you know, I'm cool like that. But this one just smells very spring-like. And I love the new bottle. Um, it's very, like, sleek and actually more girly. I feel like the old bottles are kind of old-fashioned. Like, these are the old bottles. Okay, like, these are just very big and bulky. And these are the new bottles. So I just think they're very, like, they're very slim, like they're slimmer than the other ones, and they're also very pretty. So, bottle and packaging is like what caught my eye. So, I got Amber Blush Moonlight Path, which is like a nice, like, I, would, I don't know what to call it. I guess you would call it like a lavender kind of scent. And they also got Mad About You, which is my favorite one. It just smells so good. So, I got these three lotions, and I'm not sure how much they were, but yes, I did. Bath and Bodyworks are just little candles and the first one I got is Peach Bellini and guys this smells like freaking heaven I actually wanted the bigger one but I saw a little one so I just wanted to make sure I would like it I mean it does smell like heaven and I actually have the cranberry pear Bellini so I knew I would love the peach one but this is just my favorite one out of all three of them that I got and I also got pink passion fruit which is like a nice like great kind of scent um, this one is in peach and it just smells amazing. So these two are actually like farmers market ones. They are they say fresh pink, pink passion fruit and market peach. So awesome. And then my last my favorite one would have to be peach bellini. Okay, I guess I would jump into makeup. I only have two things from there. But um I wasn't really like looking for any makeup items. I was just like out and I was just like, hey. Why not? I've been wanting to try this Wet n Wild press powder for so long now and I actually just, I was like, you know what, just go ahead and buy it. If you don't like it, then you don't like it. And I have not tried it out yet. I've had it for over a week now and I just haven't had the time to try it. If you want to see like a first impressions video, let me know in the comments down below because I would do that for you guys and honestly, let me know if you ever tried this before because I don't want to know if I wasted my money. But it's only three dollars, so whatever. But um, yeah, it's just a um, cover all pressed powder from Wet n Wild. Here's what it looks like, and they don't have a number on this, so I don't know. I'm the lightest shade. If you want to know, whatever the lightest shade is, that's my number and my name. I'm not tan at whatsoever, so definitely the lightest shade. But, and I also got this little Elf um brightening eye color. This one is in 2012 Brownstone and this is like a brand new one they actually had. So it looks like this and I actually did not buy this. Um, my friend had a Sweet 16 party which was in the dress that I wore in a second. Um, like of 
she gave me like a little package and stuff and this came in it but I just wanted to show you guys because it's a haul and definitely excited to try both of these out because they look really nice and really excited heading into the fashion and shoes because that is probably the biggest item that I have right here so let's get started the first piece that actually I'm wearing and it's just this crop top can you see this like it's a crop top and this is actually from Ross and I swear to you like I've been looking at like a lot of crop tops and this only cost me five dollars like huh it's like an identical one to this one and this is a this is not a name brand piece it's just a random crop top that I happened to find and I was just like hey but um yeah I love it I've been wearing it like non-stop like it just fits me so well uh, I just wear it with like high waisted jeans or shorts or just whenever I come home I want to like throw something comfy on. Okay and the last piece that I got from Ross is this camera shirt and this was like 6 or $7 so not too expensive. Um, very very cheap and um, it just has a camera on it and it just says just one more smile basically what everyone basically says when you're taking a picture because you know they have to have that crap. And then my favorite part would probably have to be the back of it. It just is my all-time favorite. Like, I can see me wearing this throughout the whole entire summer with a bathing suit on. So, yes. Probably not the best tan line, but um, I'll live through it. As you can tell, I found some really cute pieces for the summer. So, thank you, Ross. The next couple of pieces are from this, like, thrift store. And it's called Plato's Closet. Um... I'm not sure if they like have them across the country, not positive, but I think they do. If they do have a pledge of closet around you, make sure you check it out. It's amazing, but I do recommend if you have sensitive skin like me to wash your clothing. Again, I know they're already washed, but wash them one more time um, because I one time did not wash a pair of shirt by accident and it broke me out and it was terrible. So lesson learned but um you should always wash something from the thrift store i mean i know that but i just wanted to wear the shirt so bad so yes yeah, so the first piece is this little tank top and i actually have not worn this out once i'm like very shocked about this because i was so excited but it's just this little like cross tank top and it kind of has like the mesh detailing right here and the mesh up here and Whenever I wear this, I either have to wear a black bra or something because you can like see through this. Like I have to wear something underneath this. So, uh, I do love this top a lot. It's like a peplum top, sort of. And I just think it's very, very nice and fitting and it just looks so perfect on me. So, this is a jacket and I actually got this a while ago. Like I didn't like get this like recently. It was probably right before spring had came. So like in the middle of March. But, whatever. Um, so yeah, it's just this like really nice denim jacket and this was originally from Forever 21 and it's just like a tomboy's jacket. It kind of reminds me of like a nice, very detailed, nice jacket you would buy at like, um, one of those big stores I guess you could say. So yeah, I just got this jacket. I think this was like $20 so it's kind of on the pricey side but it was still worth it because I love it so much. So yeah, I just love how like it's detailed and how tomboyish it is. The piece is this top right here and I literally have worn this top so many times and it basically just is like a tribal print top and it's very flowy. It actually is too big for me but whatever. Um, so yeah, um, I just got this. Sorry I'm saying I'm a lot. So I got this top and this is like my favorite top out of all this probably beside of the cross top. Um, I don't know, it just reminds me of like a nice tribal print and very lightweight and I know black is not a very colorful color but I do love this a lot and I just had to buy it. And the cool thing is it has like a little zipper down the back so that's pretty cool and this was actually the brand New No Boundaries. Not sure where to get the No Boundaries brand at but love this shirt. The next shirt is this like color block shirt and this is actually from Forever 21, like originally from Forever 21 and it just has like white on the top and then like a nice tealish green and then it also has white on the bottom and I just think it adds a pop of color into my wardrobe if I just want to wear like black pants or white pants or white shorts or something my color is like right there in the middle so yes very flowy t-shirt I kind of I also like to tie it a lot because it is kind of big on me but um, I really like it, so I'm very happy I purchased this. 
And the last couple things are pants. I actually needed pants for school, so I had to get some of those. But the first one are these like little blue, a royal navy blue color. And these are actually originally from Kohl's. Cause they're the bongos section, I guess. And they're just really nice and fitting. I actually love Kohl's pants. And when I saw they had these, I was like, hey. So yeah, I got these and I'm actually gonna go to Kohl's and see if they have any more of these because they're so comfortable. I also got these pants and I haven't been wearing them since it's been getting really hot because they are kind of heavy material and they are kind of very dark. So I try not to wear this all the time, but I just have a bad habit because they're so darn cute. They're very nice and form fitting and they have this little like pattern on it. I literally thought they were leggings for a second. And the last pair of pants I got are these green ones, these army green ones, because everyone at school had been like wearing these pants, and I was like, I need to find some. So I found some at the thrift store. Woohoo! And these are actually not the ones I wanted. I actually like a, I actually wanted like a skinny jean type, but I only found boot cut. So these are originally from Hollister, and I love pairing these with like a pop of pink or gray kind of sort of I don't know but they're very nice and comforting and they're very very soft so if you're looking for really nice pants I recommend either Hollister or Kohl's or something that are actually not too expensive but not like really bad material so yes I love these pants a lot and the last clothing item is actually the dress that I purchased at Ross for my best friend one of my best friends for a 16 party which is actually at the end of March um, so I just recently got this and it basically is like a high-low and I'll insert a picture of me wearing it like I, like I have a ton of pictures so yes um but yeah I love this dress a lot I literally freaked out when I saw this I went to Macy's because I saw this really nice dress for $20 and they only had it online I was very mad about that so I went to Ross instead after I found out they didn't have the dress so I went to Ross after that and I found this really nice dress. They actually had it in this in a Toby Brown color. So I picked the green because it just fit me better and also the color is spring-like. So yeah, it just has a chevron print on it. I literally love chevron. Not so much as I used to, but I still do like it a lot. And it's just a very nice dress. It's a high-low dress and I just think it's very, very nice. I actually wore this for my interview. It was a fake one, so fake interview but um yeah I literally love it a lot so very nice form fitting and I think this was like 12 13 dollars I believe maybe a little bit more I'm not sure but yes very very nice and the last thing that I purchased or recently got are a pair of bands and I have been wanting bands for so long so I finally went to the shoe place and they were have they always have this sale for like buy one get one half off so my dad got a pair and then I went with him and I actually got me a pair of shoes. I'm wearing them, but take them off, I guess. <sighs> okay, so this is what the shoes look like if you've never seen veins before. I'm pretty sure you guys all have, but if you haven't, here's what they look like. They're just like, I just got the plain black ones because I didn't want like a big color. I was like, I've never had veins before. I don't know what they're gonna feel like on my feet and they actually feel amazing. If I don't wear them at school, then I'm wearing them all the time around the house, as you can probably tell now. But yeah, I just have a regular black pair with the white on the bottom, and I'm actually probably going to order some for my birthday. That's coming up. Woof woof, 16. So yeah, I just want to order some like, I don't know, mint green ones, sort of purple, I'm not sure. But yes, plain black ones. Okay, so that is the whole entire haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. And if you want to see more hauls, let me know in the comments down below or just thumbs the video up. Either one works. And by the way, I wanted to add a little, you know, out here. Um, I actually got my braces off and I literally am so freaking happy that I have. So if you want to see like a my experience kind of video, let me know in the comments down below. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And if you add me on Snapchat, go ahead and Snapchat me. I would love to talk to you guys. So... Thank you for watching. I love you so much, and I will see you guys later. Bye!